We started at Butler's Manor because my wife and I, Kim, have always had this dream. We've wanted to look after people and it's been a lot of fun. It's from the 1860s and it's been totally remodernized, but you can see that it still has all of the old beams and it retains a lot of the old character of the house. There's a very wide central hallway that we set out coffee and tea in the morning from seven o'clock onwards and then we do a full hot breakfast in the morning at 9.30 and we also set out afternoon tea in the hallway as well. We have five rooms, all with individual bathrooms, individual air conditioning. We want people to feel that this is a home away from home, not just a cold accommodation in a hotel somewhere. I think that if you're looking for a place in the Hamptons, but you don't want to have to go to the expense of renting mum for the entire season, you've got us. You don't need to buy a house in the Hamptons. Kim does a really great breakfast. She does some phenomenal, really good savory dishes. Uh, Manor House Omelette is a great guest favorite. And my personal favorite in the French toast department is the banana stuffed French toast. That's really good. We offer a full breakfast every morning out in the garden, weather permitting. We have a lovely garden and lovely pool. We just renovated our pool and we've turned it into a salt water pool now. So uh, there'll be no horrible smelly chemicals. Your skin's gonna feel great. One of the things that sets us apart is that we both have a, a phenomenal attention to detail. I believe that adds to the bed and breakfast experience. We have the best place to come and stay. We're the best located, we have the best food, and we've both been in public service and private service, and being a butler for 20 years, I think I know how to look after you. We are very, very grateful for all of our past guests who have consistently rated us number one in Southampton and we'd love them all to come back and stay at a butler's manor again. Mm -hmm.